So here's my electric imp, and you can see there it's got the the little thing that looks like an SD card is actually the uh, CPU and Wi-Fi and a bit of storage. That's kind of the brains of the imp. It's flashing green to show that all is well. And basically, this board on the left uh, feeds power to the imp and breaks out the connections. And this tail, the board on the right, um, has got uh, an infrared LED and an infrared detector and a couple of buttons. Now, I've just got it hooked up to uh, detect a button press and upset a record in force.com. So uh, let's take a look. I'll press the button and if we look in the device log here, uh, can we focus there? It's saying uh, button one, state is one, and we uh, called up cert and got a device, uh, a record ID back, release the button, and uh, button one is zero, and we get an empty response. So let's go to our org here. Uh, refresh our list of buttons there's our button there and we can see uh, I've turned on field history I've got a state uh, field here so that's uh, empty right now the button is not pressed and uh, I can see that I created the button the state changed from true to false if I uh, click the button hold it down and then uh, refresh the window. What we should see is see the little tick box there. The state is checked, and we can see change state from false to true. Release the button, refresh again, and uh, the state is cleared. And we can see that the uh, state changed from true to false. So very very straightforward stuff here. Uh, easy on ramp into. Uh, sending data from a physical device into force.com. Thanks for watching.